How can we extend existing DALI installations? There can be two starting situations. If there is no backup of the project, the existing installation must be read out first. The best way to do this is to click on read all. Now all operating devices such as sensors, DALI ballasts are listed together with group and scene information which are located on the bus. If a backup project is available, it can be opened. Now we come to the extension. The new equipment can now be installed and connected to the DALI bus. In doing so, the installation conditions with regard to cable lengths, cable cross sections and the maximum number of control gear must be observed. If the newly installed control gear is correctly connected to the DALI bus, we can check if it is correctly connected by clicking on the central on, central off button. Broadcast commands are sent to the bus. Even unaddressed control gear will react to these commands. After making sure that all operating devices on the bus react, we move on to addressing. Here the only unaddressed devices box must be checked, otherwise all devices will be readdressed. Then can we start the addressing. The new, in my case, control gears are now listed. They can be found using the localize function. To do this, we start the localize function and select the operating device we want to find. Now it starts to blink. Finally, we name the operating devices and save the project with the current date in the name. If fewer bus devices than expected are displayed, it could be because the devices already have an address and are therefore not considered during the addressing process. We solve this conflict as follows. We open another instance of the DALI configurator to not override the configuration of the original project file. Now we connect to the corresponding module and read it out. In our case, only control gears are installed. We select this tab and click on Read. This will read out all control gears on the bus. Now the devices with the same address should be displayed. You can recognize them by the red cycle with the exclamation mark and the number 250 at type. We solve this address conflict by clicking Delete device and addresses. Now both devices, the newly installed one and the already existing one, have no more addresses. Now we can close this instance and switch to the first one. With a new addressing process, both devices get a new address. Possibly, addresses have to be exchanged. The easiest way to do this is to use the function locate to make the searched lights blink. With this, we could solve an address conflict and keep the names in the project. If you don't have an extension of the system, but want to replace a broken device, this can be done without the DALI configurator. For this purpose, the function automatic replace must be activated in the module settings. Now the defective device can be removed and installed by a new one that has no address. That no address is available should be checked in advance. The module recognizes that an address is missing and a new control gear without an address is on the bus and assigns the missing address to the new device. Groups and scene settings are also transferred to the new operating device.